What is up YouTube? I'm here today to review the Aura Ring. This is a piece of wearable fitness technology that tracks heart rate variability, HRV. That's actually a subject I've been fascinated about for years. You see I also have the whoop strap here. This is not a comparison review, but it should allude to the fact that I'm just huge on the general idea of biohacking and I think HRV is at the center of that. So I'm gonna break down the pros, the cons, what you might like about the Aura Ring, what you might not like, um, and is it worth the money? That's ultimately the question, right? So for starters, what does it do? The Aura Ring is built around tracking heart rate variability. This is, in my opinion, one of the most important metrics you can know for ultimately achieving peak performance. HRV, heart rate variability, is the flutter in between heartbeats. Ultimately, they're able to determine your state of readiness really at any given component. So. The Aura Ring focuses on the sleep component. Um, it's, it's very, very detailed, pulls together a lot of different metrics that tracks every function of your sleep. With the data you get from it, you're ultimately able to tweak your sleep, adjust it, um, and just kind of factor in the different things throughout the day that might be impacting your rest and recovery. The Aura Ring is a single purchase, unlike the Whoop, which is a monthly subscription. So you buy this once and you don't have to pay anything else again. You get access to the app, which is, in my opinion, very, very well done. They have a very high quality app. That's where you get all your different metrics, all the details. So we're gonna open up the app here and dig through some of the different metrics they give you. It's a phenomenal app. We're gonna open it up here and comb through some of the metrics. So right from the home screen, um, we'll just, we'll jump back to Thursday. I was having a good day. But for starters, they give you a readiness score. And that's based off your sleep, your recovery, your stress, a lot of different uh, components go into that, but ultimately, this is gonna align with how you're feeling every day, whether you should train, whether you should take it easy, et cetera, et cetera. Now, what I really like about Aura is how detailed they go into the sleep world. You'll see on Thursday, I got phenomenal sleep. And if you peel back the layers here of this, you'll actually see all the different, uh, all the different measures they give you. So I have total sleep, I have time in bed, um, that calculates the sleep efficiency, obviously, 92%. Overall, it was a good night. Restful, they give you a restfulness score, so that's how many times you, you know, might twist or turn. This thing is very, very detail-orientated while you're, while you're sleeping. REM sleep, deep sleep, these are all pieces that come together to enable, ultimately, a really good night's sleep. So when you go to readiness, um, to kind of see how that score is calculated, you'll see additional components, which is your resting heart rate. Ultimately, your resting heart rate is supposed to come down when you're sleeping. Um, so caffeine or stimulants too close to bedtime can cause issues there. HRV balance, body temperature, previous night's sleep, um, sleep balance, activity balance. And ultimately, they're gonna spit out a readiness measure, which I found to be very true to reality, like how I'm feeling um, and how well recovered I am. Another huge plus about the Aura Ring is how fast it charges. I'd say like no more than 60 minutes on the charger and you're getting a full charge, it's gonna last you a full day. Each one comes with a specific charger for your ring. You actually get your ring fitted to your ring size and then the charger that it comes with matches that exactly. So my wife's ring specifically, my ring will not fit on her charger and vice versa. Um, so that's one thing to keep in mind, but overall, 10 out of 10 for efficiency and um, just effectiveness on the charging front. So one of my biggest gripes with Aura Forever was they did an unbelievable job with sleep, which really is you know one of the main components of HRV, but they weren't tracking workouts. And you know I wanna understand what's happening while I'm training. I wanna know how much strain I'm enduring. So that's still the area. They updated the, the software so that now they're tracking workouts, but it's still not to the quality of Whoop. Now that's a whole different comparison. I might do a breakdown video comparing Aura versus Whoop, but I still think Aura is worth the purchase. It's a one-time cost. You get it and you, you get access to all this data that's ultimately gonna improve your quality of life. Um, I've been able to, to improve my sleep. I didn't realize how, like when I first got it, I didn't realize that even when I thought I was sleeping really good, I wasn't hitting my REM numbers. I wasn't getting proper REM sleep. That was because of a number of different things but you know, through that understanding, I was able to improve upon it. As a result, I'm more rested, I'm more productive in my day. My readiness is generally higher. So all in all, this is probably one of my favorite pieces of biohacking technology, and I would recommend it. 
Anyways, if you like this video, hit the like button, subscribe for me, share it, all that good stuff. If you have an aura ring, I'd love to hear about your experience below in the comments. And until next time, we're gonna keep them coming. Hope y'all have a great day.